That gives you an idea of some basic overall movements in Aikido. As you can see, Aikido is about going with the flow. You take a linear force and channel it into a circular direction. If my partner stands here and decides that he doesn't want to move, and I stand here and decide I want to move my partner, it's very difficult for me to move him. It's difficult for me to push against him. But the idea in Aikido is that you're not fighting your opponent, but you're fighting the space that separates the two of you from sharing a common perspective. Once I step alongside my partner, to move my partner is as easy as moving my own body. So from here, I step alongside my partner and turn. Now I don't have to worry about this. This isn't the type of thing where I'm, I'm afraid that he's going to come up and grab my wrist and do something to me. Uh, there are situations where women may be attacked this way where they come up and grab their wrist and take them somewhere. But from my perspective, this isn't something I have to worry about. However, this kind of practice helps me to learn a principle. The principle of going with the flow and of covering the space that separates the two of us. So Aikido is about a reconciliation of opposing forces. in such a way that it's mutually beneficial. Once, once you understand how you can channel somebody's energy, when they grab your wrist. If they come in with a punch, you can blend in the same way. Okay. Using that common principle. If my partner is standing in front of me, and he has his hands up like this, he may not want to commit to a full punch, he may just want to jab at me. So what I have to do is relate to my partner's body, not to his hand. He can snap his hand out and pull it back real fast, like that. So I can't catch his wrist. But if I watch his body, as he moves in, even if he pulls his hand back, I can still get in and unbalance him. But what I need to do again, when he's standing in front of me like this, is first we're opposing forces. But I have to get to the point where now both of us are operating as one entity that I take control of. As long as I'm in front of him and I'm dealing with him like this, he can win or I can win. And it's, it's the type of thing where it's an adversarial sort of a role. But if he's standing in front of me this way, and I can move behind him and perhaps both of us win to a, a common direction, it changes the whole nature of the interaction, which is what's unique about Aikido. So let's also, let's work some techniques 